Life Audio. A Prayer to Get Wisdom by Meg Booker, read by Leo Martin. The beginning of wisdom is this. Get wisdom, though it will cost all you have. Get understanding. Proverbs 4-7 The frustration on my sweet daughter's face as she realized just how much math homework she'd saved for the night before it was all due tugged at my heart. It's easy to fly through concepts we understand, but when the correct answers elude us, it's hard. Far beyond homework assignments, we have all held back tears in moments where we can't understand what's happening to us. Wisdom isn't an elective course. Proverbs 4-7 simply states, Get it. We're called to walk through life with wisdom. Understanding requires pause. When we're diligent to set aside daily time for the Lord, He is faithful to provide the wisdom we need. John Bloom explains it like this, The Bible puts up no wall of separation between our intellect and faith. What we're told not to lean on is our own understanding, meaning conclusions based primarily on our own perceptions, because our own understanding simply will not bear the full weight of reality. It was never intended to. Through prayer, God's Word, and the people He's faithfully placed around us, To speak to us, we can walk in wisdom. The Apostle John wrote, We also know that the Son of God has come and has given us understanding so that we may know Him who is true. And we are in Him who is true by being in His Son, Jesus Christ. He is the true God and eternal life. 1 John 5.20 Let's pray each day to get wisdom. Father, you hold the key to understanding. You are wisdom. So many days we travel through our minutes and moments without understanding. We need to execute them within the walls of your wisdom. God, you are so good. You know the fabric of our hearts like the back of your hand. You've prepared the way for all of us and made us with purpose. The love you have for us leads us to wisdom and understanding. You have what we need to walk through our lives in a way that brings glory and honor to your name. We confess today, Father, our inability to slow our schedule to allow enough time for our relationship with you to grow. Forgive us, Father, for failing to foster your word in our hearts and for marinating on our problems before turning them over to you. Holy Spirit, help us to release our grip on the first minutes of our mornings and turn to you for guidance each day. When we find ourselves rushing past our time with you in prayer and in your word, slow us, Father. Be our only guide, our only source of wisdom and understanding. We lift up our worries to you today, Father. We place them in your capable hands and trust you to release the burden of them upon our hearts, to replace anxiety and confusion with wisdom and understanding. Let the truth of your word reign true in our hearts and ring loudest in our ears, Father. As John wrote, we know the Son of God came and gave us understanding so we may know who is true. We are in him who is true by being in Christ Jesus. 1 John 5.20 Scripture reminds us over and over not to rely on our own understanding. Empower us by your Holy Spirit to know when we're drifting from your wise counsel, Lord. Let Christ Jesus reign in our hearts and overflow from our daily lives as we seek to know you more each day. With everything it will cost us, We seek understanding. We search for wisdom. Bless our steps, Father. Creator of the universe, stretch our minutes to make time to seek you diligently, authentically, and open-heartedly. In Jesus' name, amen.